makes me the ideal candidate is that I have a lot of social connections. I'm like, I'm invested in many different groups, so I could have a voice of like all of MVHS as a whole because I have a lot of friends from different groups. And also, I'm very involved. Like, I'm in choir and band. Yesterday, I wasn't campaigning because I was gone for band representing Mount MVHS with a one plus excellent um, score, and so. I can represent band and choir and all the groups. I think it's a very significant experience that I've had is through choir. I was in men's choir and then I've grown a lot in choir. I've, now I'm in an undertones director and one of the um, section leaders for tenors. And what I've learned is that instead of telling people, practice your notes, be louder here, it's more about encouraging and motivating people and um, getting towards that ideal situation so that people realize um, what's best. So my job as ASP president would be to channel the energy, hear everyone's voices, really be open-minded, and then make the decisions, take the steps to get things done. So channel and focus the energy. I am the ideal candidate because I understand that the 14 people who serve in ASB can't represent a school of 1,800 people. So to lessen that gap of representation, I want to put a larger emphasis on developing the relationships with the entire student body so that no matter who your friends are, you still can have a connection through ASB and student government to make the changes that will make our school year the best for all 1,800 of us. Leadership has always been a part of my life. I've been in leadership roles since elementary school, including serving in Senate freshman and sophomore year, as well as um, being an officer in clubs like DECA. But I think the most impactful leadership experience that I've had over the years is this past year serving as the ASB vice president. Um, as a result of my time as vice president, I've gained a deeper understanding of how ASB works and the inner workings of that, as well as the best ways to make the most out of everything that ASB does and plans and the activities. Um, and in addition, an insight into our student body. And they're all things that I never would have learned if I didn't have this experience this past year. Hey guys, I'm Ulysses Zavaleta. I think I'm the ideal candidate for ASB president because I have a unique ability to reach out to all groups of people. I'm very comfortable putting myself in a position which requires me to make connections with people and really get to know what, like, get really, get to know what they have to say. Over the past weeks, I've heard from a uh, couple of clubs and individuals uh, who believe that promotions and advertisements are the correct way to increase student involvement in clubs. In my opinion, I think the students who are more involved in academics and um, clubs and stuff like that are the ones who are doing better socially and academically in school. I really believe I am the best advocate for students in this race. Some leadership experience that I possess include three years of MVHS Senate, ASB Prent Middle School, worship team leader, and leader in most MVHS choirs, which include undertones, concert choir, and synergy. Through these experiences, I have learned to work cooperatively and effectively. Um, the choir program at MVHS has shown me to always strive for excellence and nothing less. I plan on transferring that level of, of determination and using it towards school events and community events for next year. Uh, my name is Matthew Dahlstrom, and what makes me unique from the other candidates running for vice president is that for my three years in high school, I've been working hard to maintain a high GPA, uh, joining various clubs and sports, and just being a voice for the Bulldogs, um, and making lots of friends around the school from different groups. Um, another thing that makes me unique is my background. I'm diverse, so it gives me an opportunity to have an open mind, and yeah, vote for Matthew. A past leadership experience of mine is that I was accepted into this program in the University of Washington that is for colored students. It's called Young Executives of Color, and it gave me an opportunity to branch out to kids from all over the state of color that I was like, never been exposed to before, and it gave me a new outlook on school spirit, things like that, how to speak out to people, and just connect with the school. What makes me unique is I'm really energetic, and I bring a lot of enthusiasm to school events, and up until this point, I've only really been able to um, bring that enthusiasm um, and project it over the juniors, but ASB gives me the opportunity to project that over the entire school, and I'm really excited about this opportunity because that, um, that allows me to do so much more. One of my past leadership experiences is a couple years ago I got to do canoe journey, and that was basically I paddled down the coast with um, dozens of Native American tribes, and during that I um, got to experience life as a minority because I was one of few um, people that weren't Native American there, and that just put a whole new spin on everything, and I also learned not to um, judge people like based on cultural bias and I got um, and I learned to um, 
kind of learn about people based on the experience I have with them rather than just judging them. Hi, I'm Ashley Sullivan. I think what makes me a unique candidate for running for vice president is that I really enjoy talking to everyone at the school. And I think that getting out of just my friend group makes me a really socially diverse person, which is important for running for vice president because you really want to make sure that everyone feels welcome. And I'd love to help make the school feel like a more united place. I think through the different clubs like AVID, Senate, and Concert Choir, and just the sports, I get to learn how to help others and help them succeed, and I think that's what a leader is, and it's given me leadership skills throughout just watching other leaders too, so I think that's a great opportunity to get to lead the school and be an example for others. So, hi, my name is Brandon Asistito, and as some of you know, I'm running for secretary, and uh, I will keep track of records and appoint future events, such as assemblies and make them more productive and intriguing. So if you have any questions to me to make them better or what you liked, that would be good. So uh, vote for Brandon Asistito. As I've gone through high school, I've become more and more involved in the school and that's something I'd like to continue. I've been a leader in organizing events like the lounge and homecoming. I'm in leadership and a variety of different clubs. And I realize that making this school a better place is something I'm really passionate about. I want to make MVHS a school where everyone feels included and involved. I feel like I would be a unique candidate for ASU secretary because I'm very involved in the school and I'm an organized person. I'm in sports and some clubs, so vote for me. As a treasurer, I will make sure that all of the project meeting funds will be divided equally. I will meet with the proper staff to allocate funds. Thank you for your time. Vote for Kayla Angulo. You won't regret it. Next candidate. I believe I'm the best candidate for ASB Treasurer because I've been going to the school for three years now and I've become deeply rooted in its choir program and it taught me how to be a leader and an example to my peers. I'm not running for my own benefit, but rather I'm in it for the students at Mount Vernon High School and I believe that is why you should believe in the B, Isaiah B, for ASB Treasurer. Hi, my name is Crystal Sanyas and I am running for ASB Treasurer. I would be a good fit for this position because distributing money equally within clubs, sports, and other activities is important. MVHS is a school of opportunities and ideas. You should never be afraid to do what you're passionate about due to lack of money. As your ASB treasurer, I will be the voice of all students. Thank you. I feel potential in our diversity. Coming from a different cultural background, I understand how it is to feel excluded, maybe even misplaced. I want to change that for the student, the student body at MVHS. I want every single person to feel welcomed at school-related events. I want to be your voice. Well, me, Angel Camarena, for your public relations officer. What makes me a unique candidate running for public relations is my culturally diverse background, which helps me better represent the diversity here in Mount Vernon High School. Next. The thing that makes me unique from other public relations officer candidates is that I'm organized when it comes to school, and I'm hardworking and dedicated. I'm also involved in cross country and track. What makes me the ideal candidate for ASB historian is I have years of experience within two years of Senate, one year of leadership. And within those years, I've put on many school dances, assemblies, spirit weeks, and other school events. Thank you. Next, please. What makes me an ideal candidate is that I'm just trying to make the school more diverse. I'm just, I'm, I'm an eye-going guy. Um, I'm just trying to bring the school together. And I'm hardworking and won't give up on any challenges that come my way. Um, I think I'm a good candidate for historian because until this year I haven't really been very involved in the school and now that I am part of like clubs and, sp and sports and leadership doing things like the lounge and homecoming, it's made me realize how much I enjoy being a part of making the school a cooler place and either way I'm going to keep being involved in the school but historian will allow me to be, have a bigger impact. 